This is the hair transformation video that you guys have all been waiting for. So we are going to jump right into it. I used the Subaru hair dye in the color white as my bleach. And this is what you get inside the packaging. Next, I mix the two agents together and you want to make sure that there are no lumps in the mixture. So I used my plastic container in a plastic spoon to do all of that. Make sure to also wear these clear hand gloves that they keep inside the packaging because you don't want to get all this hair dye on your skin. The mixture is now ready to apply once there are no lumps in it as you guys can see. And now I am so ready to color Habi's locks so let's do this. Here's the before of Habi's hair before we do anything to it and I'm securing those locks into different sections um, before I start coloring his locks. So I'm going to be using that spoon to apply the bleach. I'm using this color as my bleach obviously. So I'm going to apply that and the rubber band that I've tied is going to act as my guide because we don't want this color to reach all the way through his scalp. So while I'm doing that, let me take this moment and appreciate all of you who are subscribed to my YouTube channel. You guys are amazing. Thank you so, so much for supporting me. And if you are new to this channel, please take a moment and subscribe down below. Also turn on the post notification bell so you are notified each time I post a new video. So I'm done applying the bleach to Habi's hair and as you guys can see some bleaching action has started so we're going to leave that on for a few more hours before we wash his hair. Six and a half hours later. A few moments later. These are the colors that we chose for Habi's hair and of course I'm going to be coloring his locks off camera so stay tuned. Three weeks later. So we are just that gang and we are going to this hair. Yeah we are going to do this hair but before that we must eat some food yes. because we are very hungry. So here we are three weeks later and we went back to the same salon that we had Habi's hair retwisted and this guy is just using some shampoo just to wash Habi's hair and he's going in with his fingers to make sure that the hair is nice and clean. Guys, let me know down in the comment section below your thoughts on how I colored my hubby's hair or if you will do anything different if you had the same colors. Let me know in the comments down below. But I think we did a really great job, most so because my hubby did most of the selection on where to apply the colors. So let me know what you guys think. But for me, I really love how these looks look and I am so much in love with this new look.
the retwisting process has begun and as you guys can see the secret here is to use so much hair wax until some residue is left as you guys can see so make sure you use so much wax i mean that's a very very bad advice i wouldn't advise anyone to use so much hair wax in their hair but that's what you get when you go to the salon i guess <laughs> because this is not the first time we came here this is the second time i will link the first video down in the description box for you guys but we pretty much went to the same salon to have hubby's hair retwisted and the secret was again using so much hair wax and the same thing is happening today and i'm like really why are people using so much hair wax in people's hair because i don't think that is healthy for anybody's hair but anyway for that sleek and neat look i guess that's why these guys use so much hair wax but I, i'm not for it i'm not for it i'm not for it at all um and that's why i love doing my hubby's hair at home so yeah So if you are watching this and maybe you are cringing at the amount of hair wax used in this video, well, I can give you guys one tip. When you go to the salon and you have your loctician doing your hair, you can actually speak out if you are not okay with him or her using hair wax in your hair to reduce your locks. You can ask them if they have other options like gel or oil. So once he was done with retwisting, he was now styling the hair and he had to put his locks in two braids. Then once that is done, he's going to have my hubby sit under the dryer so that his locks can dry much better and the style can set. We are finally here at the Urban Cut Kinyozi and uh, here are some of the quality services that they offer in their Kinyozi and the only number that is working is the second number, the first number doesn't work and here I'm showing you guys my outfit of the day. So now the Kinyozi or the barber is going to give my hubby a very nice hair trim at the sides. Make sure that the hair is nice and short and also give him a hair cut. So if you guys can remember when we started this video and now we are here. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Hey, started from the bottom, now we're here. Hey, comment down below if you've reached this part of the video. And let me know if you are loving the hair so far as for me i am enjoying this i am loving this and i think my mind looks like a snack right now <laughs> let me know what you guys think in the comments below So as much as brows are important to women, they are also very important to men. So if you are a man watching this, make sure that you have your brows groomed and trimmed to your liking. Remove any excess hairs or unwanted hairs from your brows and you'll have your eyebrows looking amazing. Here we have Habi's beard and hairline being shampooed to make sure everything is nice and clean.
leave a big thumbs up if you liked this hair transformation but i think my mind looks like a snack and this is the finished look No drama. No and drama. <laughs> of the Lord. You people of the Lord. Make sure. Make sure you do it. Subscribe. Subscribe. If you don't subscribe, you're doing what yourself. You're just killing yourself. You're killing yourself. Yes. You're getting ugly. You're getting thin. Oh, oh, oh. oh, you're wondering, you're wondering what oh. is happening to me. It's yes. because you've not subscribed to this channel. Yes. Subscribe. I don't want you to get thinner or 